Fiora, are you sure you're feeling okay? I feel a bit like... I haven't got used to this body yet. But please, whatever you do, don't tell Shulk about it. <sighs> I'm sorry, Dunban. Don't worry about it. Back when my arm was injured, it was you who took care of me. I'd almost forgotten. It seems so long ago now. Thanks, Ryan. Doing a spot of maintenance? Yeah. The sighting's been a bit off lately. You know, Mikko let us have some new parts. I could make you a new rifle if you want. Thanks. But I... I want to keep using this one for now. Shulk, get a clue, man. It's more than just a weapon to her. She can't just throw it away and get a new one. Yeah. I suppose so. <laughs> if she let anything happen to it. I bet she'd get a whack from old Atharon. <laughs> Doesn't my man ever rest? Not a chance. The lives of everyone in the colony rely on the defense force. Our readiness and our will to keep on fighting. We never know when the Mekon will strike next. No. But I won't let anyone else die. men in Fortress 3 alone. Listen to me. Nobody knew that so many Mekon would come. More people would have died if it wasn't for you. It's not about reducing casualties. We lost 30 men. And we've lost the Fortress. Those men died for nothing. Would their deaths have meaning if we'd won? Ah. <sighs> Yes. At least they would have died for something. This is the end now. It's either the Mekon or us. I don't care if I'm the last man standing. I'll take them down! Hey, Ryan. What is it? Do you want to beat the Mekon? Of course. What are you asking that for? At any cost? Even if it means giving your own life? Giving my own life? No way. I can't do anything if I'm dead. I'm gonna take down the Mekon and survive. And there's no way I'm gonna lose Shulk, Fiora, or you along the way. We're all going to win this and get out alive. If only we all thought like you. What do you mean? It's charming. What? We should get moving. We don't have time to hang around. Ryan, did you rest well? Yeah. I feel great. It looks like we're about to re-enter the Mekonis. 
Brace yourselves. Got it. Just my imagination. Are they actually gonna play that that face mech on like a sniper? Cause that'd be sick. It would fit given that, you know, the game is, you know, setting up exactly who who we're going for. Like it's going to be Gadol. It was kind of clear from the first cutscene. But then they're like, all right, we're going to scream it from the rooftops. They're, you're going to get extra... You're going to get extra cutscenes that add more... More character. So you know this is the... Uh, this is the development point for, for Sharla. Yoink. Yoink. Connect the power plug to get the high velocity lift working. Not gonna lie, I was hoping we're actually gonna hit progression by this point that wasn't uh, just hit an area, fetch quest to activate things. I was kind of hoping that it wasn't that because I was like, eh, we just came off 40 minutes of it. I think we can jump to something uh different but that's just because i'm a it's my first time through the game and sometimes you get antsy for stuff it's like there's a long long chunk toward the end of uh ff7 remake that at the time i was a bit more lukewarm on because i wanted to see the cool new parts of the uh, of what were coming up in that game and i'm the same way here i'm like i'd like to get to it but it's fine it's fine this isn't going well. Sorry. I got focus. granted my tune will probably change if we do like two more sections on top of this maybe but you know i don't see that much up here so i think i think it's fine this seems to be like the the grand finale one Probably. Uh, okay, let's just fast travel back here. Da 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 da. da, 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 da. Yeah, you know, let's take this route. It's safer. And a simple jump down from here. Nope. Well, I know I can live this. One, two, three. There we go. What? I'm in a hurry. Okay. Now let's enjoy the this conveyor belt one more time. Oh, 
Hold on, I need I need this. It's very important that I get that. Okay. Wait a minute, where are the uh, dev the devices are down there? Shit. That's my bad. Kind of hope we do like cool slide. It's the nice ramp. You know, running at this speed down hills is bad, bad for your leg. It's not great. Ah, <sighs> well then. Oh, it opens up that, and then the second quest is complete, and then we still gotta go do that. When I said last time on the conveyor belt, it was all a ruse. Man, we're, we're getting quite the workout. I think there is momentum on that jump. I think I went a lot further there. Oh, you motherfuckers are you're 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 really taking me to town, huh? Okay, fine. It's a it's gonna be roin time, baby. Give me this. I can't handle the extra choir bit. And I'd say the spin. And one more. Hey. Six figures. You know, I was expecting every enemy to get procced in that fight, but uh, they didn't. Every time I go through any sort of barrier, I'm, I'm afraid they're like, now do sh run around and do shit. We definitely have to be at the belt of this thing by now. 
at least. All right, Dunban, calm down. Hey, look, this place could have a fight in it. Oh. Huh? And here I was expecting some sort of welcome committee. I guess that's coming right after this. Are you okay? She looks very tired. Should she not get some rest? Oh, thank you. But really, I'm okay. No. We'll find a safe place to rest. We've hardly stopped since we left the village. Ricky tired too. Ricky tummy rumble. I'm with you. <sighs> Time to park our... Get down! Whoa! A mech on assault! Can anyone see them? Another vision! Nice one, Shulk! No, it wasn't. Shulk? You did well to evade me. Just what you'd expect from he who wields the Monado. That voice! It's a face to make up. Is there someone inside? What do we do, Shulk? We fight. But don't kill him. I thought you might say that. Ah, oh, shit. Ah. Uh. Yeah, we'll do with this. Every time you leave cover. Yep, it immediately got rid of it. Alright. We'll have to take this shit slow. There is an end to them. There's only three here. I was about to say, are there three? Did the little one die? So it's like, Casey, please, positionals. And that person, I'm like, come on, man. Give me a moment. I'm not, I'm, I'm paying them no mind because they're just trash enemies. How do you how do you still want to fuck me at this point? I use I use my stuff. Are they are they not appealing to you? Oh yeah, I forgot I'm supposed to be doing that. Please forgive me. I'm irresponsible and I desperately need to just give them their old weapons. They can pierce these things. Ryan, what in the fuck are you doing over there? What but I had I must have targeted some shit by accident. Oh my god. I'm very embarrassed. And let's see. You. This way. Alright, take care of them. Okay. 
Oh, fuck you. <laughs> God, this guy. How much damage does this actually end up doing? I never looked each time. It won't kill. And there we go. Okay, it's totally doable. And he only targets me. I think they realized that the AI would just... Your life would be ruined by the AI otherwise. I want to try and kill it quickly. Groups down. Kind of wish these guys weren't just, ah, eh, we're spawners, because part of me is like, there's got to be some way to murder them quickly. He can reach. Okay, we just need to get closer to the cover. Oh, I despise you. But whatever, this fight's really cool. I'm in hell. Why haven't we arrived? What? He changed. He made it so he's he's being forced to target him or some shit. Focus on this one. Oh, this is so bad. <laughs> Jade face. Well, that just makes it okay. Because he's got a cool name. Alright, ass wipe. I need to do this or you'll die. Alright, keep try to get as much aggro onto uh, him as we can. Oh, this is bad. I need one of them to do something. Ooh. We hit cutscene. Shala! Gado! It's you, isn't it? Please answer me! Let me see you!
Ah! Gado! I knew you were alive! Gado! Is that... Shala's boyfriend? The destruction of the Monado. That is the will of Lord Egil. Gado? What do you mean, Lord? What's Egil done to you? What's wrong, Gado? Why would you say that? Speak to me, Gado! This world is in disarray. I must eliminate the cause of this disorder and restore the world to its original form. That is my duty. Nay, the will of the world. Now, the time has come. The time to restore order. Gado, stop! Gado. Shala! Lady Mayneth. It is not far off now. A world in which there is no need for fear. The hour draws near. Our will shall soon be done. Whoa! <laughs> First, there is the matter of the Monado. Our victory can only be assured if we destroy the Monado before it's too late. I sense your existence. I know you are alive. Zanza, the hour is upon us. Your time has come. Shulk. Shulk. Who's calling my name? Shulk, you have acquired the ability to glimpse the future. The ability to understand the law of causality, as decided by a higher power. A higher power? Like the Bionis? Why do you desire to change the future? Why do you wish to act against their will? I do just as anyone would do. It is natural to want to change an unhappy future. If that is their will, then I choose to fight. If that is what you wish, Shulk, then you must find your Monado. My Monado? Precisely. The one true Manada. You can't do that. Because... You aren't here. Not anymore. <gasps> Is everyone okay? Yeah. That was a close one. I mean, how on Bionis did we survive that? We seem all right. I don't know. It could be that we were just lucky, but I'm sure there must be more to it than that. You were protected by the power of Lady Mayneth. Who's there? I'm Machina. 
Are you... Vanea? Vanea? Does that mean you're... Mikol's daughter? I am glad you are safe. Lady Maynath. Lady Maynath? That face was sent to destroy you. I am truly happy you're all right. You're lying. Gado would never try and hurt us. Sadly, his home's memories no longer remain. The current faces are nothing more than weapons, designed to annihilate all life on Bionis. It can't be. Faces are created by directly integrating the brainstem and metabolic organs of Homs into Mekon. Memories and emotion are nothing but a hindrance to an effective weapon. However, the early faces were experimental. Many retained memories from their former lives. This prevented them from executing their missions effectively. More recent faces have had all memories of their previous lives completely erased. Is that because of me? No, it is not your fault. Mumkar seems the more likely candidate. His attachment to us was too strong. You could say it caused his destruction. That sword one and all. You are correct. No, it's not true. Oh, my Gaddo. Sharla? Explain it to me. I mean, why does Egil want to make us into Mekon? What's the reason for all this? In order to counter the Monado. I knew it. The Monado is ineffective against the Hyentia, the Homs, against all races of Bionis. Egil suffered a bitter defeat in the battle one year ago. After that, he theorized that he could counter the Monado by integrating organic life from Bionis. Of course. Initially, the Monado couldn't take a Homs life. It can now, though. It could not harm those who share the blood of Zanza. That was its sole weakness, but Zanza lifted that constraint. Those who share the blood of Zanza? Who is that giant? The progenitor of the Homs. Him? And once the friend of my brother, Egil, before they became sworn enemies. <sighs> it was Zanza who devastated Maconis. What? anti-mechon weapons designed by Lorathea and the Ministry of Research. What a glorious sight. The coming together of all the peoples of Bionis. Yes, sir. This is how it should always have been. Then perhaps father would not. Your Highness. We are fortunate that Dixon informed us of the enemy's new weapon. Our defenses are ready. Today, we start our campaign against Galahad Fortress. Just beyond the fortress lies the Imperial capital of Mekonis. This is a battle to determine not just our own fates, but the future of all life on Bionis. We fight for future prosperity and the glory and honor of all. Troops, advance! Don't beat it up too much. I wanted to go pick some up in the Galhad Fortress. You, you, they're going to blow that shit up. <laughs> Are you saying that Zanza is to blame for Makonis devastation? It's Zanza's sword that I'm using. Does this mean we're enemies? And if so, why are you... Shulk, calm down. Sorry, I... I will take you to the Makonis capital, Agniritha. Is that your plan? Lead us straight to the gates of our enemy? Deliver us into Egil's hands? It will be quicker to show you than to explain. 
Then you will understand the history of Maconis and the battle between the two Titans. Up ahead is a lift that leads to the central factory within the chest of the Maconis. The capital, Agniratha, lies just beyond there. Uh, okay. Hello, everyone. It's time for another edition of Incredibly Long Thing with Very Bad Movement Speed. I'm your host, uh, the person who's suffering. <laughs> uh, in today's pace breaker, uh, we will walk. These are the only times where I'm like, yeah, they did a really good job with the scale of the of the world in Xenoblade, but we also have large, empty nothing. So only sometimes though, not all the time. Or not even a majority of the time, I would say. I'm just saying you could have spawned us near it. You could have, okay? That's all I'm saying. Because one, I have to fill time for the video. That that's rough. But beyond that, I feel like even if I was playing this on my own, I'd be like, fucking really? <laughs> like this is I I think we're gonna break a minute of going straight, not even enemies. <laughs> if there were enemies here, I'd be like, okay, you you populated this shit. But good lord. Well, here's hoping the next area is gonna be a bit fun, I guess. That's all that's, that's all the faith I, ha I have here. They're like, oh man, I guess we'll prepare the door now. Oh, well, here's another lift. You better fucking level up off this nightmare we just did. Woo! I am ready. Now this is what I like to see. It looks I'm seeing some color. This is a nice refreshing thing coming off the last area that was a bit more blandish, but served its purpose. This is the central factory within the chest of the Maconis. Can you see the ring up ahead? At the base of that ring is a transporter that leads to Agniratha. We must first head there. This place is full of autonomous security, Mekon. Tread carefully. 